final things that are very important if you want to come to Canada to become a permanent resident using the study route. Number one is your international passport. Please make sure you have at least six months of validity on your passport before you need to travel. If you have less than six months, please make sure you, you renew your international passport before you apply. Number two is your transcript. Now, without a transcript, it will be very difficult for any college or university to assess you for the program that you want to apply to. So make sure you contact your school or university or college to get your transcript on time before you apply for admission in Canada. Number three is a step-by-step -step system that shows you how you can successfully come to Canada in a no-hassle way. So even though you have your international passport and you have your transcript and you don't have a system that is effective, you might fail in your bid to come to Canada as a student. Now, this step-by-step -step system is called the No Hassle Niger to Canada Japan System. It gives you a search system. You can search for any school or college in Canada. You have access to professionals and it shows you how you can apply for your study visa successfully. Mm. It is a one in a lifetime pack and a one in a lifetime opportunity for anyone who wants to come to Canada as a student. Mm. Do you want to have access to this No Hassle Niger to Canada Japa system and to have access to me and other professionals that can help you in your bid to come mm. to Canada to be a student? I want you to have access to. Click the link below this video. It's going to take you to another place where you have contact with me and then I'll send you a link to access that um, Niger to Canada Japa system. Please don't go it on your own. I want to help you. Just click the link below this video and I hope to see you on the inside. Bye for now.